Hello guys welcome back to Loxio Tech YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix the flashing folder with a question mark on your MacBook while startup. This is one of the most common MacBook issues during starting up. A blinking folder with a question mark. This issue usually appears while turning on your MacBook. This means your MacBook can't find your startup disk automatically. This leads to a boot failure while powering on or restarting. If you continuously face this issue with your MacBook, Cause of flashing folder with the question mark on MacBook systems. Corrupted macOS or use of older versions of macOS. Maybe due to a corrupted file system or banned sectors in hard drives. Improper disk connection, which leads to a boot failure with the question mark folder. Deep hardware issues, like cable damages, motherboard damages, logic board IC complaints or hard drive damages etc. Solutions to fix this error. Just turn off the MacBook by holding the power button for at least 10 seconds. And after 5 minutes just turn on the MacBook. If it boot properly, then go to Disk Utility and run a first aid and also do a repair disk permission. Open the terminal and type the following command. Disk U T I L Reset User Permissions Slash Tilde Symbol Dot 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 ID Dot 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 Space hyphen, you then again tilde simple. Commands are already given in the description box. This will repair the disk permissions. Solution number two, boot MacBook with startup manager. Maybe your MacBook boot into the wrong drive path or partition. This will repair by booting with the startup manager. You can easily select the startup disk and set that disk as default. While powering on, Press and hold the Alt or Option key until the Apple logo appears. Then you will get the Apple Startup Manager. Select the startup disk using the arrow keys and press Enter. Then your system will boot normally without getting the flashing question mark. If you are unable to find the startup disk in the recovery section, it is quite possible with the hard drive is damaged or crashed due to some reason. To fix it, turn off the Mac by long pressing the power button. Then you need to check your MacBook cables and hard disk connections. Remove the hard drive and clean the connectors. And check the hard disk cables properly. If any damaged cables, PLS replace it and insert the hard disk again and do the previous steps. Still, the problem is not solved. Then the only solution is to do a clean install of macOS. Reinstall macOS using Internet Recovery. Or can install using a macOS bootable USB disk. This method will remove all your data from the hard disk. So please back up or copy your important data to an external hard drive or USB pen drive if you have. Once your data is completely back up, then do a clean install. If you want to create a USB disk for a clean install, then check our previous video to create a macOS bootable USB or install macOS using internet recovery. Links are given in the description. For doing a clean install, Turn on the MacBook and immediately press and hold the Command and R keys to get the macOS utility menu. If you have a macOS bootable USB, then click Reinstall macOS and agree the terms and conditions. And select the disk you want to install the macOS. And wait to finish the installation process. If you do not have a bootable USB, then go to Internet Recovery to reinstall Mac. Check the video link in the description to find out how to install macOS using Internet Recovery. Hope this video will help to solve your issue. Leave a comment if you have any doubts. Please share with your friends and do subscribe and enable the bell icon to get all notifications from future videos. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video and have a nice day.